Hey, yo, what up, what up? It's your boy, Pots, y'all. Today, we're going to talk about getting fired and how some of y'all be doing the most and be wild confused when doomsday come. This is how it start. You come in late for five minutes, you tell the boss, look, I was late because of the train, ah, ah, ah. He be like, don't worry about it, it's fine, life happens, right? And next thing you know, you go get an email talking about coming to my office. And you go see two people there, your manager and this new person you don't know. That person is HR. Now they go give you a note said, this is just to let you know we discussed it. So now it's officially up. In your mind, you like, all right. <laughs> No problem, Father Time. Check this out. Between the hours of 12 and 1, don't nobody better reach out to me. You feel me? At 12.01, get that shit out your head. Even at 12.59, don't talk about you want to have a word with me. I'm going to tell you, wait. I'm still on my lunch. Ain't no bantering in the hallway. When you see me in the hallway, keep it pushing. Ain't no, how was my weekend? I'm going to tell you my weekend tells you to suck my... And at the same time, at five o'clock, I'm out of here. Don't talk about your come up real quick because you just disqualified yourself from real quick. Y'all banned from my real quicks. I'm out at five on a dot. Exactly one year later, you find yourself in the same office, but this time you have a Fed case built on you. We just realized that you called out sick Memorial Day weekend, July 4th weekend, your birthday weekend after I declined your vacation request. From December 24th to December 28th, you said you had the COVID. Uh, as you refer to it as the short Amarion joint. I'm sorry we got to let you go. That's it. <laughs>